All right, guys, what's going on? Got a little video here for you. Uh, this is a package video for your PlayStation 3 uh, running custom firmware. Uh, this is for CEX based custom firmwares. This is the classic Iris Manager uh, 482 for your PlayStation uh, 3 running custom firmware. Basically, what this is, is this is just another game backup manager for your PlayStation 3 backups or PS2 backups and PSP backups uh, because it's been updating because of the Cobra box uh, you can run PSP and PS2 ISOs on non backwards compatible uh, PS3's and I'll be getting into later details with that with further videos coming out uh, but for the most part I'm just going to show you how to install this file so first what you're going to do is just plug in a USB and I have that right here and just take that file and copy it to the root of the USB drive so I'm just going to take that copy it on over so allow that to copy over like so and then once you've let that copy and you got your file over in your USB it'll show up before I lose my damn mind there we go uh, then we can go and swap over to the PlayStation 3 Okay, so here we are at the PS3, and what you're going to do is you're going to scroll up to your package manager and open that up, like I've done here, and you're just going to select install package files. Now before you do this, just pop your USB into your PS3, uh, so then once you've done that, just select install package files and scroll down to where it shows the uh, standard installation here, and it's just going to be the iris manager icon pop up, like so right here just hit X on that and uh, you're just gonna go and hit yes for the install like I'm showing right here I'm trying to compensate for the ping on this Elgato um, and then once the you can just scroll back to your game category and scroll down to iris man which actually is and so we're just gonna scroll down the bottom here and come on down to Mr. Iris Man, which is up at the top right there. And I'll just scroll up onto that. So I'll just wait for it to pick up again. And here we go. All right, so we're inside the game uh, while well, the homebrew, and basically you have your PlayStation 2 ISOs, your PSP ISOs, your PS3 games. Uh, which are your backups, which are stored in the folders, so you can have all of this and mount them to play them. So that's pretty much it. So I'm just going to se select uh, Mr. Uh, God of War here and click that to mount. Just to show you real quick. And what it should do, it'll bring you back to your XMB, like so. And I'm just going to scroll up to my disk section and uh, you'll see that it says God of War 3 so Iris Man has worked and mounted the game as we need it to be mounted so that's pretty much it so rate, comment, and subscribe guys I'll talk to you guys later uh, shortly and uh, PS4 I'm excited it is on the way alright guys